In this example, we're going to find an i-naught in the network by using superposition. By looking at this problem, we know that this problem includes two power supplies. One is this 6 volt voltage supply, and the other one is a 2 milliamp current supply. The property of superposition tells us that the overall output i naught that is equal to i naught prime, which is the current induced by one power source, plus the current i naught double prime, that is uh, the current induced by the second power supply. So we're going to break this problem into two problems, where each problem only contains one power supply. So step one, we're going to break down the circuit into two, where each only have a one power source. Let's assume that first circuit we only keep this uh, voltage source. We know that we when we keep one voltage source, we set all the other power supply to be zero. When we set the current source to be zero, it means we have open circuit over there. There's no current going through this branch. So we have a 3k on this side. This is a current I naught prime. And the circuit, second circuit, we will keep the current supply and set the voltage supply to be zero. When you set the voltage supply to be zero, it means that there's no voltage drop between this node and this node. So we replace the voltage source by a wire. Copy everything else. And this is a current I naught double prime. So step two is to solve these two problems individually. In the first part, we can first find the overall current I1 from here. So overall current I1, that is equal to 6 divided by the overall resistance. The overall resistance that is 6 plus this 2 in parallel with a 3 plus a 3 which will give us 0 0.8 milliamp. Now we can find I0 prime by using the conclusion that we got for kind of divider. I0 that is equal to 3 plus 3, the resistance in the other branch, over the overall resistance, plus 2 times the overall current 0 0.8, that will give us 0 0.6 milliamp. So this is the first part. The second part we're going to solve for I0 double prime from the second circuit. We know the overall current in, from the power supply that is 2 mm. Then we can find the current in this branch, I2 flowing to the left as um, 3 over the overall resistance. That is 3 plus 3 plus 6 and a 2 in parallel times the overall current of 2 milliamp, that will give us 0 0.8 milliamp. Then we can find a I0 double prime by applying this conclusion again, that is equal to the resistance in the other branch, 6 ohm over the overall resistance, 6 plus 2, times the current I2, that will give us a 0 0.6 milliamp. Step 3, we're going to get the conclusion. I naught that is equal to I naught prime plus I naught double prime, which gives us 1.2 milliamp.